Now to a THV 11 update. Both presidential candidates are on the campaign trail this weekend with a focus on the West. Willie James Inman has more as Vice President Kamala Harris and her running mate, Minnesota Governor Tim Walls, are in Nevada for a rally today, while former President Donald Trump is at a Montana fundraiser event. As part of their Southwest Blitz, Vice President Kamala Harris and her running mate Tim Walls are about to rally in Las Vegas. In the swing states of Nevada and Arizona, which Harris visited Friday, border security remains a burning issue for voters. Earlier this year, we had a chance to pass the toughest bipartisan border security bill in decades. But Donald Trump tanked the deal. Campaigning Friday in Bozeman, Montana, former President Donald Trump blasted Harris. Under the so-called border czar Harris, illegal aliens are stampeding into America by the millions and millions. They're coming from prisons. They're coming from jails. They're coming from all over the place. We have, they're coming from countries we've never even heard of. Harris touted her record as a California prosecutor, saying she went after transnational gangs, drug cartels, and smugglers. I prosecuted them in case after case, and I won. Trump's VP pick, Ohio Senator J.D. Vance, sat down for a discussion with Margaret Brennan on Face the Nation. Donald Trump delivered rising wages and a secure border. Kamala Harris has delivered an open border and falling wages relative to inflation and groceries and housing. A recent CBS News poll found a majority of voters think border crossings would increase if Harris wins and decrease under Trump, who has promised a mass deportation. Willie James Inman, CBS News, Las Vegas. The Trump campaign also mentioned today that they were hacked. The breach was first reported by Politico, which received internal documents from an anonymous account. The Trump campaign is blaming hackers from Iran.